Let it be known to the young and to the old, from the meek to the bold, the cruel and the cold, with silver and gold, that only Jesus is Lord. Scripted and encrypted on scrolls of flesh by the Holy Ghost, the word speaks to all who have ears to hear. For he bowed the heavens and came down with thick darkness beneath his feet. The earth and the skies before his presence flee. The soldier of Jehovah with the weight of the world upon his shoulders. Thunder and trumpets prepare the way of the coming king. For he comes with a fury mightier than that of Katrina, commanding an army more powerful than a thousand tsunamis. The conquering lion of Judah is greater than any Pharaoh or Buddha. We hail him everlasting and not Haley Silasi. For tell me which arm of Krishna is mightier than the tip of his one pinky finger. He's the only way to the Father, far beyond the reach of Allah. And if this offends you, then remember that not even Shembe is a Trinity member. For I am talking about the Son of Man. For the Son on man shines to give light, but like rain that falls on man to give life, Jesus reigns. Let all who have ears hear of the majesty of the Lord, the creator of all things seen and invisible, the mountains melt like wax before him distant shores with a voice of joy rejoice in the essence of his excellent presence let all who have lips speak and declare the deeds of the king of kings for there is a king in heaven there is a king whom kings bow down to and call him king the lord of all life yes all life for in all my life i have never heard of allah raising the dead in all my life i have never heard of buddha opening the eyes of one born blind in all my life i have never heard of krishna casting out demons or shembe walking on water but in the name of Jesus alone is all the power of heaven for the name of Jesus alone towers above every other name as high as the heavens tower above the earth every knee and every tongue will bow and confess the lordship of Jesus the soon coming king who holds the only name under heaven given unto man by which they can and may be saved see our God is Emmanuel he is infinitely beautiful divine indeed immaculate he is the bright and morning star shining brighter than any superstar he knows every star by name in the universe he has numbered the hairs on every head on the planet, past, present and future. See, you don't need to be a reverend to worship him with reverence. Come to me, all you who are heavy laden, and I will give you rest, he says. These are the words of my heavenly master pleading. He will give you peace and rest better than any silly posture pedic. See, our God is the Alpha Lion from the tribe of Judah. With the rose so mighty, it rattles the very foundations of hell. Our God is indescribable. His name is hallowed in the firmament, eternally so permanent. Spiritually, he's relevant, the only exclusive salvation element. It is him who holds the universe's souls whole-handedly by the vibrations of his vocal cords, uttering oracles that birth the miracles down the pathways of predestination, the way, the truth, and the life able to preserve this nation. Allow me to present this notion, Jesus Christ, God's gift to mankind, literally the best thing ever. Even sliced bread cannot compete. See, our God is the beginning, yet the end. He's a man, yet fully God. He's a lamb, yet a lion. He's the chief cornerstone, yet the rock of ages. He's the author and the finisher, yet the very living word. He's a king, yet a prince and a messiah, baptizing with spirit and fire. Our God is one, yet he's three. He's a shepherd, yet a priest. He's Genesis, yet the revelation, the divine in human form. He's a lamb to the slaughter, the way for the lost, the forgiveness for the condemned, and the resurrection for the dead. See, some trust in their riches, some trust in their qualifications, some trust in their chariots, but we will remember the name of our God, the name of our God, the only name that is recognized in three words. See, the name of our God is the only name that is adored by angels. It is feared by demons and given for the salvation of men. The name of our God has gone where no other name has gone. Saved where no other name is saved. Delivered where no other name is delivered. Conquered where no other name is conquered. Returned from where no other name is dared to return. Our God has done the impossible. Reached the unreachable. Defeated the unbeatable. Knocked out the undisputed. Tamed the uncontrollable. Called the unqualified. Qualified the called. And conquered the unconquerable. Our God is the brightest and morning star the light he's holy faithful and true to trust he's the passover lamb through space and time a king of kings blessed with almighty the lamb of god a sacrifice everlasting his life emmanuel is strife for the first and the last of the author of life he's blameless and right to the very son of the living god his name is jesus the christ and this is our god give me a chain give me a chain See, Jesus is Jehovah's joy, Jewish jewel. He is Judas, justifier, jubilantly joyful, judge and judiciary. Give me an E. He is Emmanuel, established eternally, everlasting to everlasting, extolled expressively, exalted extravagantly, exhibiting exemplary empathy, eternally exclusive exponent, evoking explosive excitement everywhere, euphoric emphasis, epitomizing Elohim. Give me an S. 
He is a salvation specialist, a selfless sacrifice, systematically sensational, shattered in seven seals, scriptural sun, spirit sowing sacred seeds, a sympathetic soul soother, a scriptural sharpshooter, sweet smelling savor, sanctifying sacred saints. Give me a you! He is undeniably unequaled, unsearchable, unspotted, uncorruptible, undefeated, universally unmatched, undefiled and unfailing, uniquely unlimited, uncomparably uplifted usher of utopia. Give me a S. He is a shepherd, seeking, saving, scattered sheep, sea stroller, Satan stomper, so stunningly stylish, superhumanly sublime savior, sacred special star superior, superb, sublime, sun surpassing, supernova splendor. What is his name? What is his name? What is his name? Ladies and gentlemen, brothers, the kings, the queens, the priests, and brethren, put your hands together for the one, the only, the holy, and the mighty one, Jesus Christ, the lion.